Brawlers is huge, you know, for anti heal too, but already have anti heal from Contagion. <laughs> GG. Yeah! Oh. We run, boy. <laughs> Make it more interesting. Yeah. <laughs> Best Chuck you, let's go. Best warrior you. <sighs> I mean, like, it's a, such a shame we don't have any rank leaderboard, no rewards, no tournaments, what every competitive player wants. That's why the smite is dying. It's nothing else, really. It's the highest mentality, it's the highest studio that has been holding this game back for the last 5-7 years. It's nothing more than that. The game itself is so good, but they don't want to give us basic rank functionality. They don't organize tournaments. Um, no old fun game modes in the match of the day rotation. This game could be three times huger if we only had proper community and game management. It's nothing more. The game itself is so good. Uh, all they had to do seven years ago was to build on top of it, uh, organize official online uh, conquest and arena tournaments for EU and North America, uh, work on clans, uh, add more rewards for playing the games like mini chest, ranked rewards and so on and so on. That's all they had to do. But clearly the, it's the wrong people, like people clueless, I, I, don't know, I don't know what's going on. So yeah, GG. Hello guys, good morning. Uh, I hope you're doing well today. It's a new day, a new opportunity to do something, to play something. So I said, you know, why not play a game of Smite <clears throat> and then see where this leads us. Now, I have been saying this for a while, you see... Um, the goal of Hyrule Studios uh, shouldn't be to really attract more players to Conquest, but to attract more players to Smite, okay? And if you manage to do that, you will also get more players to Conquest. Um, yes, Conquest, Aka Dota, Aka Defend of the Asians, was one of the most popular uh, map for uh, MOBA genre, you see? But mo many people don't really realize, wait, what do we play? We can go warrior, apply pressure. Chuck easy. Shark. Uh, many people don't really realize that um, Dota was just one of thousands or upon thousands of community made maps made for MOBA genre, multiplayer online battle arena. And it's actually kind of funny, like, why are we calling it multiplayer online battle arena, but then every MOBA studio is ignoring arena and they only focus on Conquest and Dota, right? I mean, I think both can be fun and competitive, but why are people acting like only Conquest is competitive, uh, like Dota, which is not, it actually has many issues, like, for example, uh, snowballing, uh, balancing around um, YouTubers, uh, hand-picked pro players, it's more, you know, you always, always have to pick meta starters, otherwise you just fall behind, so there is, I, I would say that a lot of depth in counter building is actually missing. Um, But, <clears throat> but you know, you see, I don't know, man, like, I, I feel like a broken clock at this point. It's like, I put passion into my videos, but barely watch, and I barely get any views in my videos anyway, so. And look, we, st we still have a six-year-old arena map, right? They couldn't manage to make a new arena map in the last six, seven years. Uh, there is no rank leaderboard, no rewards, no community tournaments, and then people say, why is Might not doing well? You know, it's like almost funny, you know, even though it's really sad, but, you know. We're gonna need some beats, we're gonna need some cooldown relic, um, we're gonna need, we can go warding sigil starter to make us really tanky, you can also go ah. war flag, um, I'm gonna go warding sigil way. and flat pin item rush. In uh, Conquest, you probably have to go Blue Stone to outclear your opponent, and then you can go Flat Pin or you can go Contagion, Valor, you know. So let's see. I good luck. Have fun. <laughs> there is no now we just have to apply pressure. We will school down really. We have Ward in Sigil, we can play very aggressive because we are very tanky. Yeah, voice line, as you see, you see how loud our ability affects in this game. But the problem is ability affects 
and uh, voice lines are on the same sound parameter. That's the biggest problem of uh, Smite sound design. It's a huge problem, especially for content creators. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have beats ready. We have sustain. I'm tanky as fuck because warding sigil. I couldn't play like that without warding sigil, you know. Nice. Very nice. Ulti ready already. Okay. Mm. I don't. I uh, maybe I just just don't know. Um, like on which sound parameter are voice lines? You know, I don't know. There should be voice line sound parameter. I don't know why this has to be so confusing. Now we're gonna need some cooldown. Cooldown very good in arena. We have ulti ready. We can save this guy. Nice. Okay. Now we have flat pin item. You see, we can wreck. We also are tanky because we get bonus protections from starter line and uh, from my second ability. So, can we kill this guy? Probably not. Let's go back. Nice, very good, very good. We are out of mana. Hope he survives, not much I can do. We can finish him, nice. You know, your job as a warrior is to harass enemy carries like mages and hunters, so they don't just freak us whole game long. And that's why you need at least one flat pin item. Uh, your job, you, everybody has his own job to do in a team fight, okay? Let's go some jukes online, we can go also Contagion. Uh, everybody has his own job in a team fight. And uh, people need to counter good. Like, only way how to win sometimes is not only to out damage your opponent, out pressure them. But you have to do your job and carry if they get heavily focused. If they play against like the double warrior comp, they need to buy Valor, they need to buy Bing and Blade. But often people will buy 6 damage items and then uh, blame their team. Uh, counter building probably plays even better, more important role than um, uh, in Conquest. And in Conquest is designed around snowballing. Maybe maximum 1 of course. Well. <laughs> That's why Chuck is so good. You're so tanky and then you get flat pin item and then you can get Contagion, Winglebait or whatever. <laughs> the less you think the better okay you just have to play react in the you know people say it's mindless but actually one is at its best when you are playing mindless because you're just playing you're just reacting you know it's not um when you are thinking you're wasting time you know you're overthinking it's not good we just react that's all we can do you know mm -mm. We adopt, you know, but to get, you know, to know how to build in Smite, it takes years of experience. And nobody really knows how to build in Smite anymore. They either play just Conquest, no bully game modes, they don't know how to counter build, they don't know the importance of power spikes in early game. Um, people still buy stacking items, which are slow, which can lose you the early mid game very easily. We do this now, we do this now, easy, okay. We slow this guy down. You see, and when you focus their allies, when you focus the enemy carries, you force enemy team to help them, okay? This is counter pressure. Yeah, you're gonna get blamed sometimes, especially by carries that don't counter build, you know, but hey, you have to do it. You see, I'm already getting pinged, you know. But probably Geekos just have a good int uh, want me to survive. And the more you get focused, the better contact you need. You also need cooldown, you know. 
So let's continue. Uh, we already have anti heal, we already have some jukes, you can buy Shogun Good Aura, you can buy Void Shield, uh, you can buy um, Spectral against Crit Meter, you know, many choices. And these guys there, okay. You own these two. Nice, okay. We force them to retreat back. My team cannot handle the rest, you see. We use some cooldown really here. You just stand beside the tower to push it through, you see, that's all we do. You just stand beside the tower. Okay, nice. They lose motivation too. Have to motivate your team too. Don't waste too much energy. We heal, we get shields. Thanks. <laughs> Retreat right lane. Gonna need, see they have double mage, you know, we're gonna need some more magical protection. Shogun is always nice. Especially for ready carry or animation cancels like Susano. Sprint is always good. So what we do? We get some sprint really going, okay. Are they deliberately sabotaging our game? Why do I have these fucking content creators voice lines in my games, man? Like... Who are these guys? Nobody. Just some SPL conquest players. I think they're best, but you can barely know how to play the game. Easy. So some of these voice lines are pretty stupid, you know? Like, what? And did you guys see the UI? You see this <laughs> arena map is 6 year old but it almost looks better than fucking Smite UI, like what? Yeah, I'm probably dead but... Oh shit. Jesus Christ. Easy man. Beat 5-0-8, man. <laughs> we can buy Shogun, we have double mage, we have three magical, so just buy Void, otherwise we buy Shogun. Now we can buy Void, void Shield, uh, Void Stone on a fucking warrior, man, it's insane. When you have double mage in your team, like in most arena compositions, you see most arena have three magicals, most conquests three physicals, then you can own. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's way too easy, you see that's why you need rank leaderboard rewards. Otherwise it's frustrating for me and the opponent, you know. Maybe I will need second flight pin item now. Let's see. Easy man. He got tracked, you need winged blade against Chuck or something. Sprint really. You see, a good warrior can change the whole game. You see, they have no nobody counters built, and we're gonna spectral soon against AD carry. You can't just, you know, juke and yes, you see, you cannot just tank them. We're gonna need spectral now, apparently. Uh, spectral is really good. Reduce crit damage and such. Uh, uh, now you get bonus power. Why this item is insane now? What the fuck? You get one of the best tower and you get like 30, 40 power for free. What? What is the b And people will still not buy it. And sh they will still not buy Shogun. All these items, all these support items are so overtuned. And Contagion and Spectral and people still don't buy it. Like what? And our two gives us bonus protections. But warriors fall off late, so we have to be careful. Nah, I got them. <laughs> Let's go. Yeah, this guy. Okay. 
No, I missed my combo, damn. Enemy down. About time someone helped out. Bye, cool. An enemy has <coughs> Easy. They're not just they're not even that bad, you just play good, you know. Kill slow, she cannot keep up. You really thought it was gonna be all you, didn't you? I'm tag you and I don't even kill glad shield. Glad shield, I don't know if it's necessary. Do this guy. <laughs> People think too much, you know, people think too much when they play this game. But you have to have good core, you know, you need to know what is important or what to build, then you can play like that. Juke them with Anta Slow too, on top of that, sprint, nice. You just do what you can, you see we got cooldown early, so we can do our uh, rotation more consistently. Uh, cooldown very important in arena. Getting wrecked, boy! And now run. Good warrior is everything, you know, then your mages can do damage, they don't even need to counter build. This gap also don't know how to build. Uh, gap, you should try uh, Shogun instead uh, Genji and Witchblade instead uh, mid Guardian. Aka that uh, Bevichet Relic upgrade. Uh -uh. Okay. Yeah, never buy these items on a support because you can buy a Shogun, you can buy a Witchblade, which are all probably S tier auras in the game currently. Slow her down, slow is very strong. Nobody buys Enter Slow in this game, even though Slow is one of the strongest crowd control in this game. Silence that they can do shit easy game. Chuck is so underrated. But people people never buy good items. They don't buy flat pin items, they don't, don't buy contagion, you know. They don't buy Shogun in Conquest, you know. Slow them down. I have Spectral. Oh, I don't have Spectral yet. We need to be careful. I have 4000 gold, brother. We're gonna need uh, Spectral or maybe one more damage item. I mean, this is pretty good. Yeah, nice. And a damage potion, why not? Right? They always rely on snowballing to win their games, you know, it's like, bro. Conquest is so outdated, it's insane. It's 20 year old game mode. They don't buy Enter Slow, they don't buy Valor, nothing, you know, so Warrior very strong. And then they will go on Reddit and complain, but they never know how to build. Mm. I have max cooldown almost, I don't care, I'm actually done. I only have 20%, yeah. Brawlers is huge, you know, for Enter Hill too, but already have Enter Hill from Contagion. GG <laughs> No We run boy <laughs> Make it more interesting Yeah <laughs> Best Chuck you, let's go Best warrior you Ugh <sighs> I mean, like, it's a, such a shame we don't have any rank leaderboard, no rewards, no tournaments, what every competitive player wants, that's why the smite is dying, it's nothing else, really. It's the highest mentality, it's the highest studio that has been holding this game back for the last 5-7 years, it's nothing more than that. The game itself is so good, but they don't want to give us basic rank functionality, they don't organize tournaments, um... No old fun game modes in the match of the day rotation. This game could be three times huger if we only had proper community and game management. It's nothing more. The game itself is so good. Uh, all they had to do seven years ago was to build on top of it. Uh, organize official online uh, conquest and arena tournaments for EU and North America. Uh, work on clans. Uh, add more rewards for playing the games like mini chess. Ranked rewards and so on and so on. 
That's all they had to do. But clearly the, it's the wrong people. They have people clueless. I, I, don't know, I don't know what's going on. So yeah, GG.